Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kat, if you didn't know that, now you know that. So today's video, I'm going to be taste testing Built Bars. I've seen them pretty much everywhere and I wanted to see what the hype was about, so I decided to get the mixed box, which has all the different flavors. So I'm gonna be trying each one and rating it and see what all the hype is about. Um, but yeah, there's lots of different flavors. Usually I have Quest Bars because, you know, I really like protein bars and I think they're good to have in my eating routine. So I wanted to try a new kind of protein bar. So that's what I'm going to be doing. And I'm really excited to see how they compare to Quest Bars. So yeah, if you're interested in seeing how Built Bars really are and if they're worth the money, just keep watching. So the first one I'm going to try is the cookies and cream one. I love Oreo and cookies and cream, so I have high hopes for this one. I'm going to try them both not warmed up and warmed up because that's what I do with my Quest Bars too. So here's what it looks like. It's kind of small. It's a little bit smaller than like Quest Bars it looks like, at least from the outside. But let's get into it. Ooh. Ooh, it smells really chocolatey. Mmm, it smells good. Mmm, yeah, it's a lot smaller than I thought it would be. But it's like, thick. Look at that. <laughs> okay, so let's try it. Mmm. Mmm, like the inside. It's really chewy. Mm. It's good. I don't really get much, like, Oreo, like cream flavor. It's mostly just chocolate right now. Yes, it seems like it's just chocolate. Like I don't get any like cookies and cream, you know? It seems like it's just all chocolate. But let's try it warmed up. Okay, I think I warmed it up a little bit too long. <laughs> I did 15 seconds because that's how much I usually do my Quest bars, but this is just gonna be messy, so let's just go with it. so chewy. Mm. It's good though. It's like real chocolate. Like it tastes like actual chocolate. Like you would taste in a candy bar. Wow, oh this is so <laughs> ratchet how I'm holding this. But it's good. I'd rate it like a 7 out of 10. I'd give it a 7. Solid 7. Can't wait to try the rest. Hey guys, so now I'm trying Built Bar number 2. This is the coconut one. And yeah, let's get started. Here's what it looks like. Looks exactly like the last one. I feel like they'll probably all look like this, but the inside might be a little different. So let's give it a try. It smells chocolatey. Oh, the inside does look different. I do taste coconut. It's very subtle though. Yeah, it's very subtle but it's there so I'm gonna try it warmed up now I'm gonna do 10 seconds this time instead of 15 because as you saw from yesterday it melted way too much and it got all over my hands and it was just a mess so let's do a little bit less today and see if that's better okay I think that did a lot better because it's not it doesn't look as melty so let's pick it up or maybe we should use a spoon Ah, it does work. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure if it was gonna work just because just because of how chewy it was, but let's try it. It's so chewy. I can't get over how chewy it is. Oh my gosh. I can barely taste the coconut. I feel like you could taste the coconut better not warmed up, so I give this one like a six because the coconut flavor is very subtle and you can you can barely taste it and especially when it's warmed up you can barely taste it but the chocolate is really good so yeah six out of ten i prefer it not warmed up because you can taste the coconut better when it's not warmed up 
Okay, so now I'm gonna be trying the salted caramel built bar. This one looks really good. I'm excited. Here it is. Oh, there's a little dent in it. <laughs> you see that? But yeah, looks like pretty much all the other ones. So, smells good. Let's try it. Inside looks the same as the cookies and cream one. Still very chewy. <laughs> The caramel is very subtle, like very subtle, like it's there, but it's very subtle. A lot of these bars, it seems like they're all like, just like chocolate and like with a hint of whatever the flavor, the mixed flavor is. Like the salted caramel part is like very, very subtle. The coconut in the last one was very subtle. The cookies and cream one wasn't there at all. It was just the chocolate, but mm. still good though. Let's warm it up. All right, got it warmed up. Let's see how it compares to not warm. I think the chocolate on the outside is a lot better warmed up. But again, can't really taste the caramel. Um, so I think so far, if you wanna taste like the flavor that it is, like salted caramel, coconut, whatever, then don't warm them up because when they're warmed up, you can't really taste that. You can really only taste the chocolate. But if you just want the chocolate, then you can warm it up and it's really good. So I'd give this one a seven and a half out of 10. So here's the next uh, build bar. I almost said Quest Bar. <laughs> um, this is the orange flavor. That's what the package looks like. I already took it out, but let's give it a try. Mmm. You can definitely taste the orange. Yeah, the orange flavor is strong in this one. Mm. Definitely, I think stronger than all the rest of them that I've tried. I don't know if it goes with chocolate though. It's a little strange, but I'm gonna try it warmed up. All right, got it warmed up. I don't think I warmed it up quite that much, but. Mm -hmm. Yeah, still good. Um, I give this one. I don't know. I just don't really like the orange with the chocolate. Like, it's not terrible, but I don't want to eat it again. So, I'll give this one like a six and a half out of ten. Orange and chocolate just don't really go together. I don't think. Now, time to try another one. This is the strawberry one. I'm a little nervous for this one, but at least I feel like strawberry and chocolate definitely goes better than orange and chocolate, so. So I've learned that warming them up usually doesn't do anything better just because it makes it makes it lack flavor. So I'm not gonna warm them up anymore. Well, this smells good. You can smell the strawberry. Oh my gosh, it smells good. Mmm, mm-hmm. Mm hmm you can taste that strawberry. Mm. Mm, it's good. It literally tastes like a chocolate covered strawberry. Oh my gosh, so good. Mm. If you like chocolate covered strawberries, you'll love this one. Mm. This one's good. I give this one an eight out of 10. It's really good. Okay, next built bar, mint brownie. I don't like mint chocolate, so I'm scared for this one. <laughs> or mint with chocolate. The only thing I really like mint in is gum, so. A little scared for this one, but let's see. It smells a little minty. Not too much though, so. Mm -hmm. Well, the mint flavor is not as strong as I thought, which is good. It's still there though. It kind of tastes like a Thin Mint, the Girl Scout cookie, which is weird because I used to like Thin Mints, but not as bad as I thought it would be, but still not good. If you like mint chocolate, you'll like this. Oh uh, yeah, it's minty, 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 oof. I think my rating would probably be like a four out of 10, just because I do not like mint chocolate. So yeah, but if you do, you'll like this but I do not like mint with chocolate, so. But I'm still gonna eat it. Okay, I don't wanna waste it, but yeah. Next built bar, raspberry. 
looks the same as the other ones. <laughs> Ooh, it smells like raspberry. Oh my God, that is a strong raspberry flavor or smell. Mm. Oh my God, that's so strong. Mm -hmm. Tastes like raspberry. Raspberry flavor is definitely there. Mm -hmm. It definitely goes with the chocolate, but not as much as the strawberry, I think, but better than the orange. Mm. Raspberry and chocolate is pretty good, but not as good as strawberry and chocolate. So I think I give this one seven, seven and a half out of 10. I think this is second for me. First is strawberry, I think. Okay, time to try the next built bar. This is the cherry Barcia one. It smells like cherry, <laughs> for sure. Let's see. Mm. Tastes like cherry. I don't think cherry really goes with chocolate though. I give this one like a five out of 10. Okay, this is the last one. I can't believe I've already made it to the end. I'm gonna miss having these, but let's try it. The last one is double chocolate. Very chocolatey. That's what the inside looks like. Mm. Yeah, the flavor is spot on. I give this a seven and a half, eight. Really good. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I uh, hope you guys have an amazing day. Don't forget to smile and see you guys later. Bye. Just pull me a little closer. Oh, we roaming like a coaster.